Once again, Sledgehammer has cooked when it comes to the base camos that are added into the new weapons in this season. And some of them might just be some of the best non-mastery camos in the game. So let's go unlock them. And of course, the camos I'm talking about here are the base camos for the two new weapons added into season four, the Car 98 and the Superior 46. At least that's how I think you pronounce it. Wouldn't be the first time I pronounced it the wrong though, but that's beside the point. Anyways, this is a nice little sneak peek at one of the camos we're trying to get today. This is the zombies version of it. The other one is like kind of red-ish. It almost reminds me of like the Maur de Toten, one of their pack-a-punch camos. And to get the multiplayer version of this, we need to get 10 bare bones kills with the Car 98. And I'm assuming bare bones means nothing on it. So we're getting this gun done plain. No attachments, no toppings, no nothing. If I can hit a shot, that would be awesome. And another cam I'm pretty excited about is a multiplayer version of this one. This is uh, Do The Wave, I'm pretty sure is what it's called. Either way, it's just an alternate version of this in a different color. And to get that, we're going to need to get 10 operator crouching or sliding kills, which shouldn't be too bad. But you guys know me. We're going to struggle a bit with these camos. I think that was our first kill of the game right there. I just want to get these bare bones camos out of the way so I can actually throw some stuff on this car. Because I was having a lot of fun with this when it first came out and I was leveling it up in multiplayer. I was actually hitting shots at some point, unlike what we're seeing here. And this was by far one of my favorite weapons in for 2019. So I'm glad to have it back in this and that it, it feels smooth to use. And as for the Superior 46, I don't feel bad either. Uh, I don't think it's like the greatest SMG in the game. It's probably up there, like a little above average, but it's not bad at all. Oh, hold on, I'm getting slammed. I need to lock in. There we go. And for those of you that have been keeping up with my Road to Interstellar series, uh, I will be getting back to the challenges that you guys suggested. Don't you worry. I accidentally hit that throwing knife. I have no idea how that happened. But with a new season, I want to get some of the new guns done and get some of the new camos. So it's a little bit of an intermission here. Don't worry. We will play some Doom while I'm doing whatever weapon class was suggested there. But the camos I mentioned aren't the only ones we're going for today. We also want to get this liquid looking camo. It's like purple and green. Kind of Joker-esque. And for that one, we need headshots. And I feel like that's going to be the one we're stuck on for a bit. Because I can't even hit normal shots. Oh, wait. There we go. Oh, and there's our bare bones kills. Perfect. So let's put attachments on this bad boy. Ooh, and take a look at this. If this was animated, it would for sure be a pack-a-punch camo. This is beautiful. Look, he's even got it on too. Now, who wants to give me some head? Some head shots, I mean. A little bit of dome. Just a slight amount. And by that, I mean 40 more than I already have. Ooh. Ooh. Damn. All right, maybe we need to put the sniper down. These shotguns are, are taking over. We gotta bring the SMG out. Ooh. Accidentally got a quad there. Let's keep it going. Nope, let's end it. I didn't even want to complete that streak right there. It would have just made everybody quit the game and would have made getting camos even harder. You gotta think about the long game. There it is. That should be our camo right there. That was two crouching kills and there's our Lambit streaks. All right, now I can go back to the car. Now that we got something done this game. What else do we have to do for the car besides headshots? Uh, we need to get two kills without dying 15 times. All right. That might be harder than the headshots, at least for me. Actually, no, it's not. It's actually pretty simple. I'm not going to talk down on myself right now. That's not how we get shit done around here. Ooh, was that the final kill too? Give me that. Nope. Got taken from us. And look at this. I honestly don't know which one I like better. The blue and the red look so nice. A nice little glowing camo here. I love how much they're leaning into camos glowing now. I think they picked up on that people like it. Now they're just adding it in once a season. Finally. That's a nice little double. And that's about all we're going to get. Maybe. Perhaps. Hold on. We're still alive. Nope. That's it. It might be easier for us to try to get kills with our superior right now. We need to get a few hip fire kills. So let's knock those out. There we go. And we also need to kill operators while they're blinded or stunned. So getting somebody while they're AFK is a probably good time to do that. We just need to do that nine more times. It'd probably be easier if I had a class specifically to use tacticals, but I'm going to make it harder on myself just because. Come on, we just need a little bit more hip fire kills. And a lot more stun kills. I immediately went for the ADS. That's why we can't have nice things. I went to flight or flight. And I flew. Nope, that should be our hit fire right there. Let's go. So now I really need to focus on these stun kills. These are going to be a pain. But while I don't have a stun, we can go for these car kills. It's a little vehicular manslaughter, if you will. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. 
Oh, I just been getting dumpstered the entire time I've been playing. There, I don't think there's been a game where I'm not getting pub stomped. I'm just over here getting brutalized. Ooh, at least now I'm hitting headshots and getting doubles. I'm finally getting to my flow with the car, at least a little bit, slightly. Ooh, bring on the headies. Not for me. They completely misunderstood what I just said. Oof. There we go. We got our double kills done. Or our two kills in the same life. Whatever. I was treating them like double kills. Now we just need to get 800 headshots with this. Jeez, dude. Put me out of my misery. Oh, wait. Hold on. I'm having a revival. No, I'm not. I gotta stop talking. I don't play well when I speak. I just need to not do it. Oof, we've gotten so many headshots this game though. 20, oh, we're only halfway there. Jeez, 25 out of 50. And I'm having a good headshot game. My head game is great. And here's our Hey Boo camo. This actually looks really nice in game. The pixel art looks great. And the dude in front of me is even using it. Damn, these camos are getting around. Does this glow in the dark too? Holy shit, every camo glows now. This is the most I've struggled for a camo in a long time. That's actually probably not even true, but it feels like it. I'm stuck on the headshots and the stun kills. Maybe we can get a stun kill right here. Nope, I, I went for nothing. We had the perfect opportunity to kill somebody that wasn't even playing and we got nothing. The worst part about the stun kills is that I don't even need that many. I just need 10. I literally only have eight out of however many games I've played. It's actually embarrassing. And I'm not even getting headshots either. Was that one? Please tell me that was a stun kill. Oh, we got it. Thank God. Now we just need 800 more headshots. 30 more, 20 more, whatever. Same shit. Different butthole. Dude, we're hitting shots, but none of them are headshots. Come on. Actually, you know what? Don't even want headshots. Headshots are the thing I'm least concerned about right now. I can give a shit if I get a headshot. See, look, that's all I got to do. Act like you don't need them. Reverse psychology on the game. These headshots would definitely be way easier if I took the scope off, especially if I'm playing on these small map playlists. But that would be lame. The scope just feels better. It looks better. It reminds me of home. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. No headshots, though. Ah. Uh. A quick advanced and a merciless. And it's gone. Just like that. All my hopes and dreams taken from me. Come on. That's got to be it, right? Yes, sir. Now we can finally work on gold. And for gold, we need to get killed shortly after ADSing, which is perfectly fine with me. Just basically means quick scoping. And we need to get two operator kills without releasing the trigger 15 times for our SMG. Yeah, we might need to go to hardcore for that one. Yeah, this is definitely Joker pilled, but it looks fucking sick. It's like a purple and green oil slick. I'm about to look good as hell shooting some people with it. Oh, that, that could have been a triple clat. Just a double though. I guess I'll take a double. You know, we don't want to be greedy. Oh, that should have been a clat. We still picked them both up though. That would have been nice. If only those are last two kills too. Woo. It would have been sick to start out this camo with a clat and end it with a clat. But that is not happening. Actually, it's still a possibility. Oh, it could have been right there. Damn. Fumbled that hard. We just need one more quick scope and we're done. I don't know if that counted. That was slow. Yes, it did. What's next? Two operator kills shortly after sprinting. Already what I'm doing. This should be a piece of cake. Did I really not get any progress there? Am I misreading this? Two kills shortly after sprinting in one life 15 times. Do I need to get both the kills like right after sprinting? Can I not still be sprinting? How does this camo work? Come on. That was a double kill. I was sprinting, getting the kill shortly after doing so. Okay, th this has got to be a bug challenge. There's no way. Unless they literally mean I need to get a collat shortly after sprinting 15 times. 
Come on, that's another double kill while shortly after sprinting. Still nothing? Let's try stopping after sprinting. So sprint, stop, kill, sprint, stop, almost. Kill, sprinting, stopping, killing, hit mark ring. Did that count? Nope. We need the Rosetta Stone to fucking decipher what this challenge is asking us to do. All right, since I can't figure that out, I'm going to try to get our two kills without letting go of the trigger for this. And I switched over to hardcore just to make it a bit easier. There we go. There's a few more of those and we'll be good. That should be our camo right there. Show me gilded. Thank you. Now we need ADS kills while strafing. I'm pretty sure strafing is just moving left and right. So it shouldn't be too bad. We just got to give a little tap to our left and our right key while we're moving around, while we're aiming, while we're shooting, while we're killing. And we should get this done. No problem. Oh, there it is. Easy forge. Now we just need to get headshots while moving. And then we're all done with this gun. Oh, we got one trick on this before we got it priceless. That's crazy. I guess we did use it in zombies a bit, but whatever. That should be priceless right there. Yes, sir. All right. Um, we'll try to get the car done again. I don't know what's going on with this challenge, but we'll, we'll give it another shot. But if I don't get any progress this game, then it's chalked. There's one. There's two. Let's stop moving. Did it count? No. What the fuck? Maybe I, I, I did it wrong or something. I'm still so confused on this camo. That should be one. Oh, maybe I'm taking too long to aim in. And there's our one trick. So we got our one trick on both of these weapons before getting them priceless. That's insane. Got one trick on this before even getting it forged. Or even one progress towards forged. I'm going to change out the scope. Maybe me having a zoom scope is having me hold my breath instead of keep sprinting. What if I just go no optic? It's way lamer this way, but if it's got to be done, it's got to be done. Come on, that had to be one. I didn't stop sprinting for a second. The only time I even somewhat slowed down was to zoom in for a quarter of a second. It still didn't count. Come on, that was three. Did I have to sprint and then stop? Like what? What am I doing wrong? All right, well, I'm just going to assume it's bugged. We're going to have to get this done some other time because I don't seem to be tracking. Well, since we can't get priceless, we can still take a better look at these base camos. Here's it without the HUD. I really, really like this camo. Very vibrant. Almost reminds me of uh, some laser tag. I feel like this would look really good under uh, black light. And then we have our waves camo here out in the sun. Still very, very bright. Let's go find a darker spot for this. Ooh, right in here in this hallway, even though we have this red light, it just glows in here. Very bright looking gun. Very nice camo. We also have our Pack-A-Punch looking ah camo here for the car. Still very nice. And here's our Apple camo in game. It honestly looks way better here than it does in the menu. It almost reminds me of like an Arizona can or some like crazy off-brand version of it. Great colors too. Not a single scratch on it, it looks like. And of course, our 8-bit ghost camo here. And as we found out, this one also glows. So let's go back to that dark spot. Ooh, and it actually looks really nice in here. This is not a camo I'd expect to glow but I'm glad they added it to it. Love that they're making more glow in the dark camos, but I'm going to go ahead and end it there. Thank you guys for watching. I truly appreciate all your love and support, and I will see you in the next one. Later.